Welcome back to the Choose New Year's Eve Bash. People are expecting a full dinner New Year's Eve sometimes. It's, you, you, it's great to nosh. Yeah, it's great to nosh. And you know what? You need great wines at New Year's Eve. Mario, what are some that you've recommended here? I see you got a little stash from the Vitale collection. I like <laughs> wines that speak of region that aren't too expensive. There's a Friulano, which is the old Tokai grape from Friuli in northeast Italy. It has all the minerality. It's not real oaky. It goes well with all of these dishes. If you're feeling like a red, particularly with those uh, cauliflower, I would love a nice Chianti Classico oh, from, absolutely. of course, Tuscany. Simple, young, fruity, vivacious, not impenitive. It doesn't take a lot of time to understand it. You just sip it and enjoy it. When you're having a big party, it's not about big vintage wines. No. It's about simple stuff that you like to quaff. And I love, I love rosé with stuff like this, too, because on New Year's Eve, I think it feels very, very festive, and it's usually not too expensive. Right. Bastianich, actually, your partner Joe, has a fantastic a one. A delicious And one. it's a very celebratory wine to me. Mm -hmm. All right, so, all right, you guys. But no matter, no matter what wine you serve, it needs to breathe. Because when wine mixes with air, the aromas, the, all the flavors come. It's so beautiful. You can speed this up with a wine aerator. And guess what? Everybody in our studio audience is going to go home with the Venturi White Wine Deluxe Aerator Set and the Red Wine Aerator. So no matter what you drink, you are covered. Uh, that is a good gift. Lizzie, Lizzie absolutely loves these things. They're unbelievable, and they do speed up the process. But stick around, because there is more good stuff coming. Clinton is going to share his favorite New Year's fashions.